Hello everyone, my name is CJ Siv, or Connor Sivright. My dumb little YouTube channel just hit 200 subscribers a little while ago. This happened significantly faster than I anticipated. It took me uh, over three years to reach uh, 100, and in just a little over one year, we hit 200, which is insane, and I was uh, not at all prepared for this. So we've actually surpassed 200 at the time of recording this, by quite a bit, uh, and I just didn't have time to film this because I wasn't ready. I didn't expect this to happen, uh, but here we are. So I just wanted to say thank you right off the bat. Thanks, thanks for watching my dumb videos. I really appreciate it. Um, but uh, you guys subscribe so much faster uh, than I thought you would. Uh, so thanks for that. So in order to celebrate 200 subscribers, here we are doing another Q and A. Uh, so just like last time, I tried to answer as many questions as I possibly could, although I may have missed some because there was a lot more this time. Uh, and a few are from people I do know in real life, uh, but I'm just going to ignore the fact that I know them. So uh, why don't you just pour yourself a glass of cranberry juice and come along with me on this journey. That's sparkly. I didn't, I didn't think that was sparkly. This is not a bit. I actually didn't think this was sparkly when I bought it. The Benacuda asks, How have you been? How's life holding up? I'm good. How have you been? It's, it's nice to get some respect around here for once. I'm not used to questions like this, so um, it, it's nice to be appreciated. How, how have you been? Also, the next question from Liam.Sivrod is, Why don't you ask me a question, tough guy? And that, that's a lot more in line to how I'm used to being treated. Madeline M.W asks, what would you say Jar Jar Binks' best moments are? Probably when he has sex with the queen of that one planet in Clone Wars. Jar Jar fucks more than you do. Augie1470 asks, rank your top five favorite ARC troopers. Well, obviously the big ones here, Fives and Echo. Uh, Blitz, because I had an action figure of him when I was little. Um, Fordo was cool in the 2003 one. The blue one on Kamino. There's only two that do anything. This is a bad question. You only know Fives and Echo, and that's kind of it. Augie also asks who the most overrated clone trooper is. It's, it's Cody. He doesn't do anything. He just looks cool. That's the only reason people like him. I mean, I, obviously he does a little bit. Obviously he's in Revenge of the Sith, and he's in Bad Batch a little bit, and he's in a couple episodes of earlier Clone Wars. But beyond that, he doesn't get that much to do. Even in most of the episodes he's in, he just stands there. NF Olexen asks, who has the best arc in Clone Wars, and why is it Ahsoka? I mean, yeah, it's Ahsoka. Of course it's Ahsoka. I guess Maul's a close second, but you can't beat Ahsoka. Grubby Pubulisk asks, have you ever thought about doing a podcast? You know, I actually have. Uh, my brother and I talked briefly about this. I'm not planning on doing anything. I don't have the equipment or anything. Uh, but if, if a podcast is something you guys want to see, I'll do a podcast. Everyone has a podcast these days. I'll make one if you want If you want to see it, I'll make it. Llama Mustache 42 asks, top five favorite games. Oh, you know what we got on this list. Tanopoli, Solitaire, Mahjong, Jenga, and of course, the games my ex used to play with me. <laughs> but, but no, uh, I, you're obviously asking what my, my top five favorite video games are. And of course, number one, Portal 2. I've talked about that enough. Number two, Halo 3 ODST. Uh, it's not the best Halo, but I think it has a really cool story, and that's why it's my favorite. Uh, Team Fortress 2, uh, Minecraft, and Republic Commando. Nutmeg16 asked a whole bunch of questions, and the first being, uh, how big's your dick? No, seriously, I need answers. Well, it's only about half an inch long, uh, but it has a 12 inch diameter. Bitches used to call me the dinner plate back in college. Disregarding all the cosplays you have done and ones you are currently making, what would your number one dream cosplay you would do in the world without any complications? Okay, I don't really have that many cosplays. I've got a couple, but the only good one I have is my Mandalorian one from this Halloween. Yes, I only brought that up as an excuse to show the picture, but I'm not really sure. Probably the classic Phase 2 501st Clone Trooper. It's my favorite clone. Uh, it's so good, but it's so much work to do, which is why I don't have it. 
Uh, it's so much more effort than some of the other ones I've done. Full body armor is very difficult to do and I don't have the effort for it. But part of the fun of having a cosplay is making it. I don't just want to buy it, uh, but I don't want to put all the work in it, so you gotta, you gotta find a balance there. Favorite Greek god, and only what, there's only one right answer, and no Romans. Out uh, of the main Olympians, probably Poseidon, because I've read Percy Jackson, uh, but outside of the main Olympians, uh, probably Typhon, or uh, Typhios, whatever you want to call him. I just think he's cool. He's basically a big kaiju that Zeus fought for a very long time. Uh, it's, it's, a, it's a cool story. He's the god of like monsters and, monsters and really big winds, like you know typhoons. Uh, it's cool. Are you a top or a bottom? Probably a middle. Favorite Dairy Queen Blizzard flavor now? Don't lie to me, this is serious. Strawberry Cheesecake. Please rank your favorite Spy Kids movies. The only good one is the first one. All of the others kind of suck equally. Uh, but the second one has Steve Buscemi, so I guess that one's in second place. Um, the third one has Sylvester Stallone in it for some reason, so I guess that's in number three. Uh, and then the fourth one's probably the worst one. But the last three are kind of all equal. And the first one's not that good either. Can you DM me money? I'm in a tight situation and I need your help. This man just offered me $100,000 for toe picks, and so I gave him my banking info. And now I'm broke. Please help me. I'll send you toe picks for your help. Dick picks. Then we'll talk. Can you be my sugar daddy? No. Mr. Magic Cam asks, have you ever heard the tragedy of Darth Plagueis the Wise? Uh, no, it's not a story the Jedi would tell me. Ole Guacamole It's Ocean asks, have you ever seen Good Burger? And if you have, what do you think of it? I think I've seen a little bit of it. It's not great. Alex's Swag Spam MP3 asks, do it fart? Do it clap? Do it jiggle? I don't want to justify this with a response. He also asks, sus? He's got another question here. Uh, for real though, when is the next Munch Boys coming out? I'm hoping to shoot it over Christmas break, uh, but Ethan has a real job, so that's not a guarantee. Uh, we've got a whole bunch of questions from LMRW. Uh, pick a number from 1 to 100. 17.8. Show us Jack. What are you up to, Jackie? Love me. Ah, shit. Favorite ice cream flavor? Mint chocolate chip. Can 250 be a makeover by Liam? Not that your style isn't cute. No, no it cannot. If you get to choose your last meal, what would it be? Chicken fingers. Dream job? I want to be a paleontologist. Uh, I like dinosaurs a lot, uh, but I would also love to be a curator of a museum uh, in some respect or another. Uh, and I also want to at least write for a Star Wars movie or something. Tell us why you started CJ Civ. I've always liked making videos ever since I was little, uh, and I like just rambling about stuff, so here we are. Top five things you want to do before you die. Uh, I want to release a book, that's one. I want to discover a dinosaur and name it after myself. Uh, I want to write a Star Wars movie, like I mentioned, or show. I want a lot of Lego. Like, I mean, I want a full room in my basement, just Lego, that's it. Just my, the entire floor is just, just my, just toys. Not even just Lego, I'm gonna rephrase this. I want just a entire floor of my house to be dedicated to just purely toys. Uh, like I want a whole Lego city and a huge diorama of making um, uh, like some big Star Wars battle. I want a wall of helmets. Uh, I'm gonna be a very broke adult. I also want to have some really, really good costumes. Like, I want to be a part of the, the 501st Legion, like the, uh, the cosplay one. I really want to do that. That would be awesome. But I do not have the money to make up for it. C underscore Irving asks, uh, Have you ever met my Uncle Craig? Yeah, he's my drinking buddy. He also asks, Who's your daddy? You, baby. Now that you are so famous, are you going to suffer from imposter syndrome? Are you ever going to give me those chicken sandwiches? No. If you're happy, 360 asks, let's see the fan art, baby. I don't really have any. I have like one or two drawn by uh, Megan, who is in the dinosaur video, uh, but she also drew one called CJ Horsecock, uh, which exists somewhere in the deepest recesses of my friend's Discord server. Uh, and because of that, I will not put any of her art on screen. And no, I will not elaborate further on that. She also asks if I have the best girlfriend ever. I mean, 
she's okay. I could take her or leave her, really. She also asks, why not do videos of you gaming? I'm not funny enough. I've actually recorded a couple in the past, and they were very bad, uh, so I'm not going to do them. Granted, it has been like five years since I recorded one, uh, but uh, no, I don't want to. Of course, Ethan uh, from Munch Boys and other videos asked me quite a few questions. So uh, let's get into it. What is the best soft drink? Brisk iced tea. That's by far my favorite. I'm not really a huge pop kind of guy. Uh, I don't despise it, but I would rather just drink water over most pop and other soft drinks. Uh, but I love brisk iced tea. Thoughts on trains? More of a plain kind of guy myself. What are you doing in university? I'm currently majoring in Earth and Atmospheric Sciences and minoring in Anthropology. Least favorite minority? Gamers. Favorite slur? Gamers. What is a major life goal outside YouTube? Like I said, I want to be a paleontologist. I, I like dinosaurs. Breadman11 asks, have you ever jump ejaculated into your janties? I don't feel safe answering this one. Max R. Brayman asks, why won't you become an anime video essay channel? Because I don't like anime and I don't want it. Graydon asks, what's your favorite sex position to do with the boys and why? Cuddling. He also asks, if you were to die from any torture method existing, existing in or predating medieval times, what would you pick? Probably Persian crucifixion. Well, I think that about brings us to the end of this video. Hope you had a good time, I sure didn't. Uh, but I wanted to close this off by saying thank you. Thank you for watching my videos. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for providing me a void to scream into. If you weren't here, I'd still be making these videos, but it's sure comforting to know that at least someone is listening, probably. 200 is obviously not a whole lot in the grand scheme of things on YouTube, but I mean, 200 is a lot of people. <laughs> it's, it's kind of insane to me that we've even come this far. Uh, but, but, but thank you. Thank you so, so much. I hope to do another one of these at 300, um, but if you guys keep up the rate that you're subscribing, we're gonna have hit that before this video comes out, or at least be very, very close to it. Uh, so we, you may not have a 300 subscriber Q and A. Uh, what maybe we'll do this again depends on how fast you guys subscribe. Uh, I think if we keep this rate up, I think we can probably beat PewDiePie by next Christmas. Uh, so keep it up. Uh, thank you so much for watching, subscribing, liking my videos. I appreciate it. I, I really, really appreciate it. So thank you all so much for watching. I will probably have a couple of videos out before the end of the year. Uh, so, so social media links. You can find me in a few places. Um, you, you do that. Have a good night, everyone. I'll see you all next time.